Okay, so today we're in the Adirondack Mountains, and we're going to go herping. We'll probably get a lot tonight, cause since it's dusk, and we'll try again tomorrow at dawn if we don't find enough. I'm going with my sister, Natalie, and we hope we find some cool herps. We got our first herp of the day. It's a little American toad. He's peed on me, but that's to be expected when handling a wild toad. And we're probably going to find a lot of those. So, let's let him go on his way. Probably off the path would be good. And let's go find some more. We've got our first reptile of the day. It's a little snake. It looks like an eastern garter, and it's angry. It's bit me a couple times already. <laughs> it's coming right towards the camera. Let's see. He or she? This is a he. He's a little angry right now, but eventually he'll calm down. And so, once he knows we're not going to hurt him. We found him right by this nice stream. And he probably hunts all the frogs he can eat. Back into the wild you go, right where we found you. Another garter snake. Not sure what species this is. Oh, musking on me, aren't you? I'll have to look back on this footage later. Not sure what species it is. We definitely don't have the species back in Maryland. This is a... Whoa, calm down, calm. He's just he's chilling in the water. This one's a female, but she's pretty young. Ow. <laughs> We're finding all sorts of garter snakes by this little stream. Okay, let's put her back now. Okay, and whoa! Lost them for a second. Oh my god. <laughs> Green pond frog. You can see he's got those webbed toes for swimming. And he lives in this pond where he found all the garter snakes. Hopefully none of the garter snakes find him, or he'll be dinner. There was another one in here too, but I only managed to catch one of them. And we actually see a third over there. Well, let's put him back, see if we can catch some more. Or if we can go back in the bush. Where's he go? Look, some blurry footage of a pond frog from afar. That one's perfect size meal for a garter snake. There's a nice field over here. We're gonna see if we can find some rat snakes or skinks over here, or pretty much any herp we can get. We just checked the field, but it's super dry, so I'm pretty sure the only thing we caught here were ticks. So right down the hill from that field is a little swampy area, and I'm pretty sure we should be able to find some stuff here. It looks very similar to where we found all the frogs and snakes. Okay, so we found this big pond in the middle of the woods. And if you look down here, it's just swarming with tadpoles at every turn. Like more tadpoles than I've ever seen in my life. This is super crazy. Especially over there, it's like black with tadpoles. I'm gonna see if I can find what frogs they came from. And it's hard to see because it's really far off in the middle of the pond, but there's a little newt swimming around with all of the tadpoles. We've got some already hatched frog eggs right here. Jiggly. <laughs> Get a better shot at this one than the one before. 
super cute. Seems pretty freaked out, trying to pretend he's dead. He's not. So, let's bring this one back in first room. Probably one of the parents of those tadpoles back in the pond. Can be. He's still trying to pretend he's dead. But he's super cute. Chipmunk hole. Okay, so we were climbing this mountain, and we found this really tiny red lizard. So we have no idea what type he is, but he's super, super cute. And we're going to go research him when we get home. So, we'll see. He doesn't seem like some type of skink. Let's go release him where we found him. I just want to sit there. So we're walking back down the mountain. We're seeing like a bunch of those little red lizards we found. I'm definitely going to try and see a what type it is so I can tell you about them later. Okay, so we were just herping at night, hence why we're inside because there is no lighting outside. And we found this giant toad. Just a normal common toad. And he is really big. And I'm going to name him Chungus. We're going to release him right after this video, of course. Sorry about the lighting. It's really dim in our room. And, well, it's night outside. We also found a queen ant. She's pregnant. You can't see in the video at all. But, whoa. Sorry, I jumped. <laughs> Yeah, maybe this will go in the bloopers instead of the actual one. But, here's our toad and our queen ant. Okay, my hand for perspective from the toad. <laughs> okay, uh, you can end the video now, Natalie. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to release Chungus. We found him on the road, so we're going to put him right on the edge so he doesn't jump back into the road. Oh my god. No, I'm not into the road. Over there. Into the bushes. He doesn't like the bushes. Well, that's your home. Oh my god, he's so adorable. Okay. <laughs> it's another toad. Ooh, we're in the woods. <laughs> woods. Ow. You okay? Smack in the face. Oh, poor tree. Did you hurt it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a little the little tadpole ponds ahead. I think we'll have better luck with um you know the catching of the frogs or snakes or whatever the heck's over there this time. Hopefully I think the best way to get down is over here. Stay tuned. When we go to Florida, we'll be herping for alligators. What? Uh, no. <laughs> I mean, you can. I'm not. Okay. My YouTube video will go viral. You don't have a reptile YouTube. Well, I have a YouTube. Yeah. Uh, that's not a reptile. So what? <laughs> so you're just going to randomly, in the middle of all your gaming videos, you're going to have a random, um, <laughs> herping for alligators? Oh, well, isn't this lovely? It starts raining as soon as we get here. I don't even think it's raining. It's just wind and the trees are wet. Okay, oh. I'm going to end this and then we can look for frogs. I got it. Whoa. Really? Again with the whoa and the frog? Let it go. Ah, there it is. Got it. Okay. I always do the whoa when I find a frog. <laughs> He's cute. Just another frog. He's done a bunch of these so far, so I'll just release him. Be free. Dude, that's land. Okay, he is a frog. Not so many frogs today. Hello. Another froggy man go. Got him. It's another frog. Why do I catch so many frogs? Frogs just love me, don't they? Here. It's another
another one. Did the same one come over there? No, because it's jumped in over there. Hey, okay, cute. Be frog. Be, be frog. Be free, froggy man Joe. Or don't be free. Eh, whatever. I'll hold him for a little bit because he's cute. And Natalie caught her first ever herb. It's a little baby American toad. So cute. <laughs> ah, no, I'm already zoomed in. <laughs> okay, so found this huge water snake down by the pond. She's not actually that huge, but she's the biggest snake I've ever actually caught. She's pretty thick, but that's sort of a water snake thing. You can see she bit me a couple times and I picked her up. She also must. She's not very happy. She's pissing a bit. I was having to hold her behind her head for a couple minutes because she just wouldn't stop biting. But she's good now. And anyone from the south, don't panic. She's not a cottonmouth. We're up in New York right now where these aren't native. A lot of times water snakes like, like this one are killed oh, down on pretty much anywhere because people think they're cotton mouths or water moccasins, whatever you like to call them, because they just look very similar. They mimic them because cotton mouths are extremely venomous. This one, however, is not venomous. That's not why I'm not very worried about getting bit, and that's why I was just picked her up and I'm still holding her. And that's why I'm not on my way to the hospital. <laughs> so. She's actually pretty small for a water snake, but she's the biggest snake egg I've caught. We just don't have snakes this big back down in Maryland. So, found her over by this pond in the grass, so we're gonna release her there. Okay, so we're back right where we found her on this little path down pond back there. Okay, so, don't bite me again. I see you looking at me. <laughs> We're gonna release her again. She was just sort of hanging out in the sun over here. Oh, I see you looking at my arm. Let's put you down before you do that. Yep, and be free. <laughs> I'm king of the rock. Chungus, chungus, you're humongous. Chungus, chungus, you look like fungus.